Good morning. At approximately 1.52 a.m., officers were doing proactive patrol in the area of Jefferson and Orange Avenue. This has been a hot spot for criminal activity where we've seized a lot of guns over the last several months. Probable cause was developed to suspect the driver was involved in a drug activity. The suspect disobeyed the commands given by the officer and made a movement as to retrieve a firearm. One officer shot the suspect, who was an adult Hispanic male. The suspect was transported to the hospital and pronounced deceased. FDLE will be handling this investigation at this time. And I'll take questions. One of the biggest things, obviously now learning that this was, you know, someone driving down the street, but one of the biggest things that we've probably all been thinking about is downtown safety, especially when it comes to the bars downtown. Do you feel like OPD is doing enough to create a safe environment for people who are going downtown to enjoy a drink? Downtown's always been very challenging just because of the large amount of people. And this is a part of, we've been very proactive in our enforcement and our patrol. This is the area we seize a lot of firearms in. And I think we're doing the best we can. I think we there, there's always more you can do. But we have a lot of officers down there working very hard to keep everyone safe. And we've been doing a pretty good job so far. Can you kind of, sorry if I'm interrupting anyone, can you kind of explain how the actual shooting went down? I mean, how did this happen? Oh, the officers were doing a drug investigation and basically the, 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 the person who was the suspect made a quick movement to, uh, to retrieve a firearm and then the shooting happened. Was the firearm recovered? At this time, I'm standing right here, no it has not, but we're still investigating. Were there other people in the car with him? Uh, that's a part of the investigation. When you said it was a drug investigation, uh, can you go more into detail about that? Uh, we recovered drugs, and there were drugs that were seen, which caused the officers to to stop and get out with the person. Have you reviewed the body cam? Uh, yes, I have. And what, what what does it show? It just shows basically what I told you. There was the officers were stopping and engaging with the person, and the person made a quick movement, and the uh, the officer fired his weapon. Any update on that? suspect's uh, condition? Oh, right now the suspect has passed. Okay. But he passed at the hospital. What's the procedure for the officer that was involved in the shooting? Is going to go on leave? During the As in all of our officer involved shootings, the officer will be placed on administrative leave for depending on the outcome of this investigation. And like I said before, FDLE will be taking over this investigation. How many rounds were shot? I'm not, I'm not sure at this time. The drug investigation, I uh, was this a sale of drugs? Was it all just happening inside a vehicle or? Oh, that's a part of the investigation, but I know that drugs were seen and that's why the officers stopped and checked out with the person. This person who was uh, shot and killed, uh, we, does, does that person have a criminal history? Or is he, are you familiar? With I'm not aware. This is the embassy part of investigation. We're just starting out, so I'm not aware of his uh, history at this time. Was anybody One else involved arrest, well arrested question. or? Yeah, at this point? I'm sorry, you asked me. Was anybody else arrested that was with the suspect? No, not at this time. All right. All right, thank you.